Neil Sunset. This is Neo Sunset. Uh, this is really good for lo-fi R&B. I like it. It just makes me want to... <laughs> Man, I get pulled back and forth. I've been wanting to mess with the 808. And then I'll be wanting to mess with Neo Sunset and other expansions. I like the expansions. I, I just like how they work. Um, the best... Like I said, the best way to review this is to combine it and make tracks with these expansions. I think that, that works the best. So let's actually... Let's do that. You know what? I think I want to add the 808 RD8 with this. Just on the spot. This is not planned. Um, this is not pre-done. But I think that I just want to experiment with this. So we got the uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And uh, I'm going to erase the pattern on here. Right? And... Uh, you know, I'm just going to add sounds. You're going to hear it because you heard you heard it. I know you can hear it because I'm checking this out. And I know this is a review, but I, I, I'm going off the rails here. So let's do this. And let's just do, do it like that. I'm just going to make a track with it. One, two, three, four. All right. Oops. Well, shift, redo. And we're going to take all those other sounds off of there. Clicking and dragging. We got that. We're going to go to the pattern. And we're going to double that length right there. Right. We got that in there. I know that drums are coming in hot. And easy. Right. We got that working there, but this has nothing to do with expansion, but I'm just feeling the creative vibe. That's just how I do. If you learn anything about my channel, you know sometimes I just like to create how I want to create. So we got that 808 going in over there. Right? Let's make that snare mix it. We just add sounds. So let's record that in. Two, three, four. And let's add another track. Let's matter of fact, let's grab another kit. We're just gonna grab a random kit from the expansion itself. And we're just going to add that in there. See what happens. Let's add in there. And we're just building stuff together. That's a nice crash symbol for the one. 
So let's go back to the one. Hit that crash right there. Now what would be really cool is if my Moog was working. So let's see if my Moog is working. See, that's one thing about expansions is that they're supposed to play nice with each other. And I don't even know if y'all can hear that right now, but we're going to see. I don't think so. So what I'm going to do is just let's move the sink on. Let's think fast on our feet. How do I do that? Well, in this case, we'll go to none and we're going to do a plug in and we're going to find a bass sound in the fabric XL plugin. Let's put that in there. So you're hearing different things move it. And I know it defeats the purpose because you want to really check out this. I think it's a good kit. It's got flavors. Um, they're very modern. I think this is a great kit for R&B music. You know, um, just a lot of great flavors in there. Really fun. I think it's a cool thing. I think it's a good plug-in if you want to do some lo-fi. I think it's good for R&B, but really any one of these kits can be used for any genre. But some, like, for instance, the Arab Music Kit, too, I think that's a lot of a good modern trap. But if you want to go more on the R&B side of things, I think this is a good fit for that. All right? So let me know if you like this kit. Do you think this is something you will use? Let me know in the comments below. You're watching the Dilio T2K YouTube channel. I'm your host, Dilio. I'll see you on the flip side.